the volume that's created by rotating this around the y-axis. So what we need to actually do is resolve this for x. So that's simple enough. We just um, multiply x and y together and then divide 1 by y. So we get 1 over y. <laughs> so here's, um, excuse me, we're solving it with respect to y now. So it's, it's being flipped around. So this is what... Um, not y equals 2, but um, x equals 2. So we'll have, this is essentially going to be pi, because pi, basically it's pi r squared. But we have two equations, so we have we have our x equals 2, and then we square that, minus our 1 over y squared. And we're going from, <laughs> um, so this is 1, so this is one half here. So to get uh, to two on this, we have to put in one half. So we're going from one half to two. Okay, so go ahead and integrate this. We end up with pi, and then this is four y minus one over y squared. And actually it becomes plus, because we, uh, and a, um, uh, it's a negative values pulled out and then we're going from one half to two okay so we'll go ahead and solve this so pi and then for two we get eight plus one over four uh, minus one half times four is two plus two so this is um, 8.5 minus 4 gives us 4.5 times pi or 9 over 2 pi and that's it alrighty I hope this helped you out I appreciate you watching have a great day